At a recent concert, Drake informed his fans that he would no longer be performing his collaborative song, Work, with Rihanna. Drake tells his fans he's not doing Rihanna's collaboration anymore. On Saturday, February 3rd, a video surfaced on social media of Drake performing at the start of his It's All a Blur tour, Big as the What? in Tampa, Florida. In the clip, Drizzy appears to be standing on a hydraulic lifting platform as he prepares to fire something from a cannon. While the instrument is being set up, the play begins on Drake's 2016 collaborative song, Work, with Rihanna. That's when the Toronto rap star told his fans that he wasn't performing the tune. I'm not singing this song anymore, you can sing it for me, Drake told the crowd. It's not clear if Drake was being petty or if he felt like switching up his setlist by not performing older songs from his expansive discography. Along with this video, another clip appeared on social media of Drake wearing a jacket with a fake dinosaur spine on the back. This unique jacket was designed by famous Tokyo artist Masakatsu Shimoda, who is known in the fashion world for his distinctive dinosaur-inspired headwear and clothing. Drake's It's All Blurry Tour Big like what? It will run until April 16th. See the remaining tour dates at the bottom of this post. At this stage of the game, fashion should be included in the basic elements of hip hop. And the rappers gracing the red carpet at the 2024 Grammy Awards are proof of that. As the day begins at Los Angeles's Crypto.com space on Sunday, February 4th, Stars from all over the rap game are gearing up to attend the 66th annual Grammy Awards. Hip-hop is primed and ready to take center stage on the red carpet on the biggest night in the music industry. Whether or not they're nominated for the coveted Golden Gramophone Award this year, we see a slew of elite rappers below wearing freshly tailored tuxedos and designer gowns in almost every type of icy drip. A notable example from last year's Grammy Awards was Future, who walked the red carpet in 2023 in a pristine white suit alongside his daughter, Londine. This time, Hendrix is nominated in the Best Rap Song and Best Rap Performance categories for his contribution to Killer Mike's Scientists and Engineers, which also features Andre 3000. While every rhymer in attendance shows off his best outfits on the red carpet, many hip-hop artists are hoping to walk out of the awards show with some new hardware for the trophy case. Despite being nominated 12 times throughout her illustrious career, Nicki Minaj is looking forward to her first Grammy win. Nicki is competing for Best Rap Song and Best Song Written for Visual Media alongside I Spice for their collaboration, Barbie World. A win in either category would be a first for I Spice as well. Although Drake has been very vocal in his disdain towards the Recording Academy, he and 21 Savage were nominated together in four categories including Best Rap Album with 2022's, Her Loss, and Best Rap Song with, Rich Flex. 21 was also nominated in the Best Melodic Rap category for his guest appearance on Burna Boy's 2023 song, Sittin', On Top of the World. Other nominees tonight include Kendrick Lamar, Doja Cat, Nas, Qui Lyr and more. The 2024 Grammy Awards take place tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern Time 5 p.m. Pacific Time at Crypto.com Arena in Los Angeles. The show will air live on CBS and stream on Paramount+. Drake wore a jacket that showed what appeared to be a fake dinosaur spine on his back while performing on the first night of his It's All a Blur tour. On Friday, February 2, a slew of videos surfaced on social media about Drake releasing his It's All a Blur tour, Big as the What? In Tampa, Florida. One clip that stood out was Drake talking to concertgoers while wearing a jacket with a fake dinosaur spine on the back. Last year, Canadian rapper Drake allegedly mutilated Rihanna in the song, Fear of Heights. Fans claim on his latest show that Drake is still upset over the breakup. Over the weekend, Drake performed in Tampa, Florida, and when his single with Rihanna played in the background, Drake told the crowd, I'm not singing this song anymore. You all can sing it for me. The accusations arise when Drake faces criticism for seemingly unable to let go of his ex-girlfriend Rihanna, as he refused to perform their song at a recent concert. A fan recorded the 37-year-old Grammy winner addressing the crowd while their 2016 collaboration, Work, 
played in the background. The 35-year-old billionaire was also mentioned in context. I don't sing this song anymore, he said into the microphone. You can sing it to me. Drake and Rihanna were rumored to have an on and off romance that lasted for several years before it ended for good sometime in 2016. If you find this content suitable for you and you will like to have more contents like this please take some time to subscribe, turn on notification button so that you will be the first to watch the next video, like, comment and share this video. Thanks for watching.